Contemporary Country Album of the Year. And the nominees are My Mind's Projection, Brad Cox, produced by Matt Fell. Home Truths, Catherine Britt, produced by Catherine Britt and Michael Moko. Darling Hurst, Darling Hurst, produced by Pete Dacey and Jason Resch. Wanted, Jane Denham, produced by Brian White and Brian Bunn. like an out on the run Wanted by it. Kids on Cassette The Wolf Brothers Produced by Nick Wolf, Matt Fell Lindsay Rhymes Johnny Gasparis Scott Bradley Stephen and Patrick James Wowzers Wowzers Ladies and gentlemen the golden guitar for the contemporary album of the year goes to Kids on cassette, the Wolf Brothers! Well done, boy! Woo! Kids on cassette was inspired by the songs that brothers Nick and Tom Wolf listened to on the cassette tapes and boom boxes when they were kids in Tasmania. Written and recorded between Australia, Nashville and Canada, the album features collaborations with Amy Shepherd. Jack Jones and international superstars Low Cash. Nominated in seven categories this evening, this win takes the Wolf Brothers Golden Guitar Career Tally to five. This, yeah, everyone's talked about the last couple of years was just a nightmare and um, you know we had a lot of highs and a lot of lows and to stand here tonight with this and with Matt Fell again um, is absolutely incredible. We started this album pre-COVID in Matt with Matt in the studio and then the world sort of shut down and um, then Nick thought well I might do a couple of songs. I might delete half of what Matt did and, and <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah and then you know I'd have zooms from Nick and he's like eyes oh, are here. Oh, why did I do this? Yeah, yeah. Um, but it was it was like it was a experience and um, but the songs come from our life. Um, we're very proud to be in contemporary country. You know, Tamworth is a festival full of tradition, but it's also a festival where so many things are accepted. And you can go down Peel Street and you can hear pop country, you can hear rock country, you can hear bluegrass, you can hear rockabilly, you can hear bush ballads. And you know what I love? I know I speak for Nick, we are so proud to be a part of this industry that accepts all of that and we love waving the flag for contemporary country and I really hope we get to do it for many more years to come. Yeah. So I want to thank you for supporting us. We want to say a massive thank you to our wives, uh, yeah. Tani, Ali, our yep. families. Uh, we want to thank Steve White Management, Brogan, Steve, Kerry and uh, we want to give a huge shout out to Zach Taylor who was just a huge part of this album come together, yeah, it wouldn't course. be happening. Uh, without Zach. Zach was um, one of the sort of uh, unfortunate casualties in COVID. He's now uh, he's a he's working he's a roofing. roofing. He's a roofer. Uh, that man belongs in the music industry and I'm sure he's going to find his way back as things get going. Yeah, so thank you so much, Zach. Bloody legend. A our incredible team, BMG, uh, Australia, Broken Bow in the States, um, everyone who helped produce this, Nick Wolf, your work and Matt yeah. Fell. What you've done for us in the last couple of years with the last few albums, mate, has changed our career and our lives and we love you and I can now officially stand on this stage and say he's a Tasmanian! Oh, he's a Tasmanian! He's one of us! Uh, one of us! Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Lindsay Rhymes, uh, Johnny Gasparic and uh, at MCC in Canada, uh, Patrick James and Scott Bradley Stephen. Um, yeah, thank you yeah, guys. Thank you. And a massive thank you to Frank and Josh uh, for us OPR. Love you guys. Thank, thank you heaps. Thank you. Go man. Oh, thanks, man. Uh, thank you. I'm going to be selling CDs of the other deleted half of the record after the show. Um, uh, thanks to these beautiful guys here. I love you guys dearly. It was an honour to make this record with you. Uh, Steve and uh, Brogan White, who just made this whole process just so effortless and easy. Thank you, guys. It was a real pleasure to work with you. Uh, and finally, um, the love of my life and my lady of the mountain, Amber. Love you, darling. Thank you so much. Thank you.